point of Maple Park News. Today is Friday, August 11th, 2015. Today is an A day. First up is James with today's lunch menu. Today we will be having rice noodle bowl, spicy tenders, or a cheeseburger. Sides are seasoned rice, sesame broccoli, salad, and applesauce. Thanks, James. Next is Officer Johnson with an episode of Cops. And welcome to this special edition of Cops. This morning, we are on location, standing in front of the text to tip banner here in the main hallway. Many of you may recall that we did a COPS episode introducing the text and tip program last year. So why am I doing another episode? Well, there are two reasons. First, just to remind everyone again that text and tip is a service that you, the student, can participate in by telling authorities via anonymous texting details of a crime, either at school or in your neighborhood, that has been committed or is about to be committed. And second, text the tip is now affiliated with Crime Stoppers. If you watch much TV, and I'm sure you've heard how Crime Stoppers has helped the community in solving crimes anonymously. The citizens have grown to trust the program, resulting in the surrounding community becoming a safer place to live. For those of you who don't know how it works, it's easy. First, open your cell phone, cell phones, text window message. In the to window, type 274-637, 274-637, or crimes. In the text window, type Vikings, followed by your tip, and hit send. It's that easy. The text is then sent anonymously. No one will know who sent it, and it's sent to a secure server. The text is then washed of any identifiers, like your phone number. A unique identifier is assigned and then forwarded to authorities who then act upon the tip and take action if necessary. So, put this number in your contacts and we'll take a picture of the banner so you have it handy. And with your help, we can make Maple Park and the surrounding neighborhood a safer place to live. If you have any questions, please don't hesi hesitate to talk to me. Thank you again for listening, and I'll see you on the next episode of COPS. Thank you, Officer Johnson. In sports news, congrats to the 2015 through 2016 Maple Park Cross Country team. Way to go, Cross Country. Thanks, Jaden. Johnny. Remember, Monday is Labor Day, so there will be no school. That does it for this week's Maple Park News. Remember to be respectful, responsible, and do your personal best. <laughs>